Mm -hmm. I messed up a little bit. Mm -hmm. Ooh! Ooh. <laughs> no! Move every time! Move every time! Move every time! Move every time! No way! Move my phone! Move every time! Originated from the Middle East. Uh, I think it came from Persia. And the Egyptians also uh, used it as well. Yes, so Queen Cleopatra swears by this. So you guys know this is some good stuff, okay? <laughs> okay. Rose water has many benefits antioxidants, it's an anti aging property, antibacterial, and it's also anti inflammatory. Yes. And it also soothes the throat. Um, if you have sore throat or whatever, you can create a rose water tea that'll help with your throat or whatever. And also tighten your pores, because y'all know. Oh my God. You don't want to see the pores. Yeah. Yeah. It be looking like, it, I don't know. Sometimes it makes me feel like I got crazy. Yeah, like, I'm it like, be looking a hot mess, yeah. So I'm like, no, no. I need something to tighten up my pores, not have my pores open. Um, it also soothes fine lines, so that is amazing, especially for Every wrinkles. Yeah, oh, okay. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> so yeah, so you know this is an anti-aging property, okay? Right. And it also um, hydrate and soothe your skin as well. Yes, and it reduces redness and uplifting your mood. Okay. First of all, redness right now. Exactly. I have a few little stress bumps out right here on my skin, so I know this is gonna be definitely a good thing for me to use at this moment. We can use rose water for many things, such as bath water, bath time, your skin. A toner, perfume. Even food. <laughs> like what? Like who put rose water in their food? But it oh. has many benefits. Right. Food as well. Yes, cooling and mist as well. So that will we we will be actually um, performing today is a cooling mist rose water spray. So hold on to your seats, get your popcorn, do what you need to do. Let's and let's get started. Yes. Right. So our first step will be um, taking our taking roses. the roses and peeling the uh, petals back. And adding them into our water solution. I mean, I'm breaking. Okay. Yeah. 
I went to attack these pores. Me too. <laughs> okay, we will now uh, pour water, but you do not want to use tap water at all. You need water that is distilled. It's already clean. Okay? Yes. So, when pouring the water in the uh, pot, you need to make sure that you just cover by the top of the, uh, the leaves, the petals. Because you don't want to dilute, over water and dilute the uh, rose water. Oh, nice. And make sure when you uh, put it on the stove or whatever you're cooking it on, make sure that uh, you put it on medium heat. Apply it in there. Oh, yeah, makes sense. Mm -hmm. 
I messed up a little bit. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Ooh. No. Move your thing. Move your thing. Move your thing. Move your thing. No way. Move my phone. Move everything. Get pull out of here. Enjoying our videos because um, you know the views are going up, and we appreciate y'all. Yeah, so much. So keep on. Yeah, so tell a friend, to tell a friend, and um, continue watching. Anywho, you guys, I hope you guys enjoy this video again. Right. Peace out. Oh my bad. We hope y'all enjoyed this this video. So don't forget to click that bell to get notified every time we we up, upload a video. Yes. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Peace. Adios. <laughs>